A ring video goes viral after Raquel Pearson and her husband caught Amazon delivery driver Monica Salinas praying outside their home. Many of us rely on delivery people to bring us needed supplies. We all learned how necessary these service people were during the pandemic when social distancing and stay-at-home orders were in effect across the world. Still, some of us continue to rely on these services for essentials or our health, which makes this story of an Amazon driver so heartwarming. In May 2020, Raquel Pearson and her husband relied on delivery people maybe a little more than most. At the time, they had an eight-month-old son named Lucas, who was born with an aberrant right subclavian artery and they needed certain supplies to keep him alive. It is rare for this condition to have adverse symptoms, but our son has had a very tough time eating since birth, the mother told Newsweek. Since he aspirates while drinking, we have to thicken his bottles, and we get very regular deliveries of thickeners to our home. His aspiration can cause him to choke, cough, and have abnormal breathing. Because of this, the Nampa, Idaho, family is grateful to those who deliver the supplies they need for their son. They wanted to let them know that, so they posted a note at their door. Thank you for delivering our food and packages to us. It read, We have an infant with medical needs, and online deliveries are essential to his health. You are keeping our son alive and well. We are grateful to all who are on the front lines delivering to our family. One day, while the family was waiting on set supplies, they grew a little anxious. So they pulled up their ring camera to check a delivery. That's when they saw something that shocked them. The driver read the note, then stopped and prayed for Lucas. Lucas' condition has been very difficult for us, so we were very thankful and taken aback by her kindness, especially during this pandemic, Pearson told the publication. She posted the video on Facebook in a since-deleted post, sharing a slice of goodness with the world. Quickly, others recognized the driver as a woman named Monica Salinas, whom they claimed had a heart of gold. The video went viral, and word got around to Salinas. She too was touched. I just stopped to do what my heart told me to do, to say a prayer for the baby and for the parents because that's got to be very painful for all of them to see their baby hurt and struggle, Salinas told KTVB. That makes me happy. Happy that God can touch people like that, you know? It means a lot to our family, just genuine kindness. It's just a breath of fresh air to see stuff like that. Lucas' dad, Derek Pearson, added to the publication. It's really powerful, and we appreciate any positive energy that is sent to our family right now. During the pandemic, many of us began using the phrase, we're all in this together. But look closely and that term has applied to our neighborhoods and communities for a long time. We don't always realize how much we rely on the kindness of strangers, but it's stories like this that remind us how much we all do. It only took a moment of Selena's day to stop and send well wishes to that little boy, and it only took a couple of minutes for the Pearson family to leave that note of gratitude on their doorstep. Yet both actions sparked kindness and warm feelings around the world. Going out of your way to thank someone doesn't just make the recipient feel good. It makes you feel good as well. You can easily thank someone else by posting a note on your door, writing a thank you email or text, or even going the old-fashioned route with a handwritten note in the mail. Everyone wants to feel appreciated, and showing our appreciation to others can lead to some pretty wonderful things. We just need to stop and take a moment every now and again to practice our gratitude.